What is up, everybody? The History Guy here. Now, I don't want this channel to turn into a naval combat-only channel. Uh, you know me better than that. You know there's a lot of things I'm much better at and much more knowledgeable of. But it seems to be the hot thing right now. Uh, Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts, Ultimate Admiral Age of Sail. And so, since a lot of you I know are big World of Warships fans, I thought I would give it a try. Now, a couple of things up front. Number one, I have played World of Warships a few times on the Xbox One. This is the first time I've ever played it on PC. I just installed it. I don't know what all this stuff is here. Um, so I'm going to close some of these things out here. But uh, just installed the game literally just now. Man, it takes up a lot of space on your hard drive. Uh, but that's okay. So I thought I'd dive into it a little bit today. And uh, as with all of the games that I play, I absolutely welcome all of your fantastic input. Expect me to fail and fail miserably. Expect me to be a complete noob and do things that will make you cringe. Uh, but we're going to have fun doing it. So uh, let's take a look at what we've got here. Um, we've obviously got battles right off the bat. Uh, we've got co-op battles, fight against bots. That's probably how we're going to have to start because I will get completely wrecked by any human opponents right now. Uh, and I understand, you know, I've played a lot of World of Tanks as well. Uh, so I understand the basics of how this game operates. And I think, at least to start, why don't we go with this Tier 1 German Cruiser? That might be a fun way to kind of dive into things. So let's go ahead and do that. I don't know why my port's the Philippines and, and why if that necessarily matters a whole lot. That's probably where we're connecting to the game. Uh, so we're going to go to New York because that's the closest to me. That's a, I think it's about a six-hour drive from where I live. Oh, okay, I guess that's just our background, eh? Well, in that case, I want London for sure. Uh, that is my dream trip. I hope to get there someday when we get out of debt and I have enough income to do that. And thank you to all of you guys who are slowly getting me there. All right, so we've got a German Hermelin uh, cruiser sitting in London in the port here. Let's take a look and see exactly where we are in London. That's pretty awesome. Okay, very cool. Uh, it's Christmas time, so we've got some festive things happening out here. So, all right. So we can see our stats, survivability, artillery, AA defense. I don't think we're going to be facing any uh, of those things to worry about. So let's just dive right into a battle and see what happens. Okay, so uh, here we go. Standard battle. Let's get started. Oh, I haven't even like taken a look at any of my settings as far as graphics and things of that nature. And, Okay, well, we're just getting started here. Let's take a look at the settings while we're at it. Um, everything's kind of set to high or medium, I guess, for now. Audio, controls. I have a pretty good idea on the controls. I'll deal with all of this stuff later, I guess. We're just trying to dive right into the battle for now. So, All right, here we go. So we're set to high explosives right now, and I think that's probably where we'll stay with our cruiser. Um, so that's free look. How do we aim the gun? So we click. Okay. How do I get the, uh... Where's our controls? Alright, here we go. Hard to port A, hard to starboard D. Yes, I am learning all this right now as we go. Where's our, uh, select our crosshair. There we go. I want the dynamic crosshair. Save changes. Oh, that's how we do it. We just scroll. Okay, cool. Got a little barrage balloon in the air there. That's kind of awesome. Looks like we're headed right toward the enemy. The controls are definitely very different than what I'm used to on the Xbox One with this game. So it's going to take a little bit of time for me to adjust to that. So it looks like we can just use Q and E to turn. Ah, oh, there we go. Now, I don't know yet like how I want to be if I want to be facing him like this or if I want to be broadside or what what my speed what I want it to be like but let's see how we do against this computer opponent oh way out in front okay, get a little closer so let me know your tips your best uh, tips for all these things what do I need to know you know I have a basic understanding of how the naval combat is supposed to work but in this game, I, I know there are obviously some things I'm going to need to learn. Oh, that was a really bad aim there. I guess we're close enough now that I can just fire away. 
Oh, now he's gonna do the same with me, so we gotta be careful. Let's turn a little bit. Let me get the kill. Let me get the kill. That was way off. Terrible. That didn't do much. I got penetration on it. Everybody's firing at this guy right now. Oh, he's trying to capture the base. That's right. He's going all Leroy Jenkins on us. Kind of hard to hit him head on, it appears. It appears that's probably not the way to go. Oh, hey! Somebody killed him. Did I get the destroy on that? That is awesome if I did. And totally not expected. Okay, who else we got? I'm looking at the map here. Oh, over there. I gotta wait for the guns to get aimed, I guess. They're not quite there yet. Let's slow down. I'm in a tough spot now where it's kind of hard to see. All right. Oh, he's sucked. Now he's reversing. So those shots aren't gonna hit. Looks like he's gone. Our team has taken the lead. Of course they have. I can't really see anybody else, so I guess we're gonna have to have to get moving here. Oh, there we go. That guy's behind that icy little island there. I'll get there, guys. You know, I'm, I'm playing the computer, and, and it's my first time playing the game on the, on the PC, so definitely going to be a learning curve for me. Can't quite see this guy yet. Almost. Oh, yeah. Doing a little point blank range with one of my uh, one of my teammates here. I, I'm probably going to overshoot him from here, or just hit the island. Let's get this island out of. That's actually a really smart place for him to park. I can see why that helps. There we go. Well, of course I'm detected. He's detected too. All right. Let's Go down to full stop. We're gonna sit right where we're at. Now I can get more shots on this guy. That broadside to him. Yeah. I know I'm double clicking like as though somehow I'm gonna fire faster than just my simple reload. Come on, get him before the other guy does. No! Don't let him get the kill! So close, so close. Oh, he fired into the water that time. There we go, all right. And that was the game winning kill apparently. And we get kind of this shot of that, very cool. So we won 14,000 uh, in silver, 260 experience points, 6,000 damage cost, 36 target hits, two destroyed, two set on fire. I know, I know, I'm getting all excited like a noob. Uh, against a bunch of uh, computer opponents that were designed to be really weak and easy to beat. I get it. I get it. I do. So I'm curious to hear from you guys. Uh, the the benefits to getting a premium account, obviously I know you get experience faster. You can probably unlock things a little faster. By the way, if you want to add me as a friend on here, it's the history guy right there. You can see on the top left. Uh, so what's in the recruiting station? What's that all about? Let's take a look. So I guess it's just uh, a place where you can uh, invite friends, get rewards, that kind of fun stuff. That's cool. Uh, premium shop is there. Rewards collected. Uh, let's see. Uh, we already got a reward apparently. So uh, let's go ahead into our tech tree and our modules. And looks like the Dresden is going to be our tier two cruiser that we can unlock. Uh, and we've certainly got the money and the experience to be able to do that, it would seem. Um, so I guess first we have to kind of get all of the available modules for the current ship that I've got. And it looks like I've actually got all those. So I guess we can just go right in and purchase this ship. Yes, no. Ah, so I guess I, I've only got 260 uh, XP and we need 350. I need about 350 to be able to get this particular uh, Dresden. So I guess we're gonna go into another battle here, another co-op battle. I'll do that and then we'll take the Dresden out for a spin. 
Okay, here we go. Let's do this again. It looks like this time we're headed south. Hopefully we can get a couple more kills before one of my teammates beats me to it and there are a bunch of us out there. Nice thing about the uh, these light cruisers is of course that they turn pretty quickly. Uh, we do got some planes. I think those are more for aesthetics than for any actual gameplay purposes. So let's kind of run in here and see if we can grab this thing here. There's an autopilot feature, which is kind of awesome. Uh, so I guess we can just tell it where we want to go here. Autopilot mode enabled. How do we do more than one? Hold shift. Okay, cool. That's that's pretty awesome, actually, because that allows for the waypoints. That certainly makes things easier than having to worry about that. See how we're doing. See if we guessed well. Uh, we're definitely in the air a lot longer. Oh, I hit him. It's not as well as I probably would have liked to. Let's go ahead and slow down. Oh, there's a lot of shots of flying in right now. There we go. We got some hits. Hopefully I'm not crashing into anything. Hopefully that autopilot keeps me going without having to worry too much about running into islands and such. Ooh, we got a nice hit there. Took out one of his guns. Gonna lose the chance to finish him off though. I guess we move on to you then, sir. There we go. Oh, I think we might hit the... Yeah, it's going to be the last one. Alright, where are we going here, guys? Alright, we're good. Are we in reverse? Yeah, I think we're in reverse. Okay, whatever. Which, of course, means I can't see anybody. Oh, that's why I'm in reverse, because I... I thought I was slowing down and what I was actually doing was backing up. Okay. It's really too easy to uh, accidentally do that. So I, I understand now. Okay. Well, let's, uh, let's look for a target over here then, shall we? Turn our guns that way. This guy seems to be pretty well sitting still. Hello. Penetration. A little off there. Let's go ahead and turn a little bit. So this guy's almost dead. Let's see when we finish him off. Oh, so close. Ah, oh, somebody else got him. Easy at this stage. I mean, I'm dealing with a, you know a light cruiser with a couple of guns. Don't have to worry about torpedoes either to fire or to f have them come at me. Um, so you know it's all pretty simple at this stage. I know it's going to get crazy complicated here before long. We got a, one of these ships that's really close to me. Where is he? Oh, oh there he is. Slow down, slow down. And he's sitting right in front of my teammate. Uh, let's back up a little bit. Got a hit on him, but now I'm out of sight. Go the other way. There we go. Oh, man. Somebody's firing at me, it seems. Get a go to a full stop right here. We're, after after all, we're playing the computer, so I'm not too worried about sitting still and being a target. And looks like this is the last guy. Come on, get a kill! Yes! Once again, I get the game-winning kill. I think it might not have been me. I could be overreacting for no reason whatsoever. So good, we got 137 uh, 
experience that time. That should be, yeah, we did get that destroyed at the end there. That should be enough now to buy the new ship, yes. Dresden. Research, yes, thank you. We got ourselves a new ship. Purchased for 67,000, yes, please. And so now we've got some new things. We've got a Dresden B that we could upgrade to. We've got a better gunfire control system. So let's go ahead and take the Dresden out for a spin now. And so after we do this one with the Dresden, once I've, I've tried it out at least once, we'll go ahead and dive into an actual uh, versus real opponents type of thing here. So let's take a look here. looks like we've got, got a couple of casemate guns on the sides. Um, some, is it, are those spotlights up on top of the towers? We've got the triple triple funnel thing going on here. Battle starts. All right, map. I'm right there in the center, so I guess you know what? We'll go mode right here and then. No, not that way. But yeah, we'll, we'll go, I guess we'll go that way. All right, so we've got AP shells if we, if we hit two, but we're gonna stick with the AG for now. Looks like a lot of folks are going over toward A. I'm making my way to B. And I probably won't spot anybody until we get up here, closer to where we can see what's happening in C. 24.3 knots appears to be our max speed. We've got 15,800 hit points. I didn't even pay attention to what the hit points were on the other one. Obviously, probably smaller than that. Kind of a bucket of rust I've got here right now. I guess I gotta stop looking in different directions because I'm causing my guns to change their aim. Nothing spotted so far. I appear to be all by my lonesome though. All my all my friends are going around to that side or this side. And then there's me charging right down the middle. So maybe we'll go ahead and head over towards C so we're not too crazy far away from the rest of my friends. Man, still no opponents, though. We've got a lot of guns on this thing. You can see it looks like there's 10 guns total. I don't know what size they are. I don't know, maybe 5 inch? 4? There's probably a way to find out. I was spotted, which means I probably can spot someone, too. Okay, here we go. He's firing at me. Let's go ahead and slow down. Disable autopilot because we uh, kind of hit and just started slowing down. Yikes! I'm getting fired on by more than one. I better start moving here. Ship is on fire. Yeah, my ship is on fire. That's Perfect. not Get ideal. Ahead. Okay. Yee. And I hear a torpedo too. Oh, geez, that that would be why. It's this guy that's coming right up at me. Man. Totally different story with this battle compared to what I was doing before. All right, so maybe charging in like Leroy Jenkins was not the ideal way to do this. like where the best place is to hit these things and where not, etc. Things like that. But for now, it looks like I'm going to knock this guy out. Alright, cool. Yeah, I did. Now let's get out of dodge. Autopilot mode enabled. We got two enemy ships side by side. I ought to be able to hit one of them. Long way off, so a bit of a, a bit of a wait to see if I hit. Uh, 
everything was out in front on that one. Looks like he's not moving. There we go. Oh, let's hit this guy. Beautiful. Incapacitated. last shot before he's out of, out of range. Autopilot yeah, autopilot disabled again, I know. Looks like I didn't really have anybody to hit on that side. Alright, I'm doing alright. A, a little initial kind of screw up. I, I took about a third damage there. But I think we're okay now. Lesson learned. Follow the, follow the rest of the team. Don't go off by your lonesome and get owned completely. I don't know if, yeah, we're probably gonna be a little behind him on that one. Now he's turned. Those might hit. Oh, so close. Yeah, this guy's out of range. Oh, ouch. That was about a thousand damage. Yeah, they're out of range at the moment. Hello. Nine kilometers away. Probably gonna be need, need to be closer to like right here. Fire on him. Way behind. Now we got a couple hits there. I guess a little out of range. Where are we headed exactly? All right, let's head into B, see if we can deal with him there. No enemies in sight at the moment. Caused 12,000 damage, so that's pretty cool. This guy's probably gonna die before I hit him. But we'll take a shot. Yeah, he's gone. Is Our victory is in sight. No thanks to me, Autopilot that's for sure. Mode disabled. Autopilot mode enabled. Okay. This guy's 9.3 kilometers away. Does that mean there's a torpedo coming? Is that what that is? I actually don't have any idea. Might just mean I was detected, I don't know. Torpedo going at this guy. Beautiful. Oh, this is going to be dangerous. I don't want to hit my own teammate. He's crossing right in front of my field of fire. Beautiful. Assisted in capture bonus on that one. Take him out. Oh, he's backing up now. Destination reached. Autopilot mode disabled. Beautiful. Did I get the game winning kill again? Come on. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, you're just toying with, with me, World of Warships. You're making me feel like I'm better than I am. No, I didn't get that kill because I had already destroyed one. Uh, it sure felt that way, though. All right, we're going to do one time taking on some real opponents and probably getting owned miserably. Let's see what happens. Okay, looks like we're going to have destroyers, cruisers, and a few battleships. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be... I'm going to play this super safe and... Probably a little bit scaredy cat is how I'm going to do this. So I'm going to go with the crowd. I'm going to stay in the back and I'm going to try to stay alive as long as possible. Um, all right. So I don't know which way I'm going to go, but we'll go straight until 
I see what other people do. And then I'll follow the crowd. Because I don't want to die. At least not right in the first, you know. I don't want to be the guy that gets one-shotted by the battleship. Action stations. All right, here we go. Getting up to speed. What's everybody else doing? Let's see. It seems like everybody is pretty much going straight for now, so I guess that's what I'll do as well. Until that turns into a really bad idea. Is there any kind of a chat or something? I guess there is over here, huh? Uh, H gives me my, my ranges. Spotting range, detectability range. Firing range. So, teams are starting to make captures, so we're starting to earn some points. And it looks like somebody's being fired on over here. We don't see... Oh, there it is, right there. I'm sure I'm not going to hit him from here. But, I'll fire anyway. Alright. Alright. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to here. No, just go to there. And then go down this way. Let's do that. All right. We are definitely sighted now. I'm a little worried this guy's going to come up and hit me with some torpedoes. And I'm not going to like it at all. I'm going to slow down. Definitely coming at me to give me with a torpedo. He has to be. I can't hit him. There we go. Let's turn around. I know you're firing torpedoes at me, dude. I know it. Oh yeah, torpedoes. And they hit me. Of course, I'm not paying the least bit of attention to those things. I'm just hitting here trying to kill this guy. Yeah, I know. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Oh, that one hit me dead on. I'm toast. All right. Stay away from the destroyers. Lesson learned. Thank you, Sergio JMH1, for ending my life. Well, there you have it. So here's your chance. Let me know your thoughts, your tidbits of ideas, your advice, uh, besides avoid the destroyer that's coming straight at you and is obviously trying to kill you with torpedoes. Uh, use the comment section below. Let me know if you want to see more from this. I'm not going to do this all the time. I want to get back to some land battles because we're doing so much naval activity already. But we are probably going to go down to like maybe every other day with, oh, that was pretty cool sinking with Ultimate Admiral uh, Dreadnoughts and... Uh, age of sales. So use the comment section below and we will see you again soon. Thanks for watching.